What is going on guys? Grave here. Welcome back to Black Ops Cold War. And today I was coming to talk about my experience over the last several days playing the second weekend or the cross-platform beta here on Cold War. And I have actually been really enjoying myself. I know that may not be a popular opinion. It's kind of hard to tell who all really enjoys the game and who doesn't. Because as you guys know, it does not, it does not matter what the game is. If there's anything usually posted online when it comes to Reddit or Twitter, it's usually people you know, complaining about things they don't like. And so a lot of people see negative stuff about games. A lot of people aren't posting positive things, and that goes for any game because most of the people that are, you know, are enjoying the game are, are playing. They're not online posting things about, you know, I like this, this, and this. The majority of things, like I said, you see are, are people saying, you know, this needs to be fixed or this needs to be removed or there's a bug here. And then, of course, there's always people that's not going to like games, and that's perfectly fine. There's people that like Modern Warfare that don't like this, and there's people that like this that don't like Modern Warfare. That's how it's always gone, like I said, no matter the game you play. But overall, I've really been enjoying my experience. The very first beta we got, of course, on PS4 was the Alpha. Now, of course, it was an Alpha. It was a true Alpha. It was buggy. It had its issues. But I felt like the game played very well. It uh, played a lot smoother than it did the first weekend of the beta, which I felt like last weekend the connections were just not good at all. Uh, this weekend, I feel like it has improved. Now, I would say probably 85 to 90 percent of the games I've gotten in have been good connection-wise. There's still that chance, you know, you're going to get in a game that's not very good connection-wise. Um, that is kind of disappointing, but at the same time, that's always been an issue in my opinion in Call of Duty. Since I have started playing COD, back COD 2, uh, COD 4, Modern Warfare 2, Modern Warfare 3, Black Ops 1, Black Ops 2, all these games uh, up till now, I just feel like there's times where you get into games and it's just connection is, is awful. You're going to get beat. You're just not going to be able to have a good game. It's just how it goes. It's just, unfortunately, that's how Call of Duty is. That's how a lot of online games are. But overall, my experience, like I said, I have been really enjoying it. I do wish we had the option to choose what mode we wanted to play. I don't like that they've combined everything. Uh, if you want to play 6v6, it feels like, you know, you're stuck playing Control or Dom or Hardpoint or Team Deathmatch or, you know, whatever the case may be. There's probably a lot of those modes people don't want to be playing. I wish we could choose the modes we wanted to play. I also don't like, uh, you know, this kind of did that too with Combined Arms. The Combined Arms Assault and Domination have been put together. And I, I think when the game comes out and people can play the modes they want to play, some people may enjoy their experience more. I know a lot of people right now aren't playing as much because they said they don't want to go in and play Kill Confirmed all the time. They may just want to play Domination or Team Deathmatch or Hardpoint or whatever the case is. Um, but overall, I really have been enjoying my time. Um, I, I feel like the guns are balanced overall pretty much across the board. Uh, you can do pretty well with any of the assault rifles. You can do pretty well with any of the submachine guns. Uh, you can do very well with the snipers. That would be the one weapon set or one weapon weapon group. I think that it still needs to be looked at. The hit scan is absolutely insane. And with right now, the way the snipers are, it makes everybody in the game seem like a sniping absolute god. And I'm not a great sniper myself, but it almost feels too easy at times. I feel like if you're going to run around in quick scope, you should have to be a very good sniper. Even if you're going to run around or not really run around, but kind of just hard scope or grandpa scope. You know, just kind of sit back and wait and pick enemies off. You still have to be a pretty decent sniper. Right now, it feels like as soon as you pull up, you can pull the trigger instantly. And it's like your sights are automatically on. I don't know what it is. The hit scan is way off, in my opinion. The hit markers are still kind of off. I know it was supposed to have been looked at and fixed since last weekend's beta. Uh, it's supposed to be kind of the chest and up. But I have been hit in, in kill cams in the thigh, in the elbow. Uh, some of them don't even hit you. It's like you'll see the kill cam and the hit marker will be way off. Um, I feel like the snipers still need to be tweaked. I, I think the snipers are really the only class that still needs some balance. Everything else so far feels pretty good in my opinion. And as you guys know, if, if you've been around the channel for a while, I'm never a fan of buffing uh, or nerfing weapons in game. I'm always a fan of, you know, if you have something that's very good, buff everything else up to that. I hate when they start nerfing stuff too much. Because you get to that point where, you know, things were really good, then it's absolutely awful, and then it comes back to it later on, they have to buff it back. It, it just gets kind of frustrating at times. So hopefully they won't be too much of that this year, but sadly it is Call of Duty, so that probably will happen. But overall, like I said, I have been enjoying my time playing. I know people on PC have been having some issues. Everything I've heard on Xbox is kind of the same issues we've been having here on PS4, so it's not anything too crazy. But leave me a comment, let me know what platform you've been playing on. Have you been enjoying your beta experience? Of course, I'll be on playing some more today and, of course, tomorrow before the beta ends. I'm going to make a little bit of a more in-depth video uh, here in the next day or so, kind of talking about the things that I would like to see changed before release. 
But anyway, guys, like I said, leave me a comment. Let me know your thoughts. Overall, been a fun experience. I've had some really good games, had some really fun games uh, with friends, that kind of thing. And that's kind of what, you know, gaming is all about. So, like I said, leave me a comment with your thoughts. And, of course, if you liked it, hit the like. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do so. If you are a subscriber, make sure you click the bell icon in the top right corner so you know all my videos go live. And be sure to check out everything down in the description. Uh, my Twitter, the community Discord, and, of course, the affiliate here on the channel, GT Racing. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.